Welcome back. I'm Fran Haskins here with NSUSportsSpartans.com. We're here with head men's basketball coach, Coach Jones. Coach, tell us, with less time to prepare than you have before, what's been your biggest challenge? Exactly that, not having <laughs> enough time. You know, I think that we're, we're, we're very far behind where we normally would be at this point. And it's hard to catch up. So we're going to try to do the best job we can to be prepared for November 27th. And do you find yourself with, you know, not having as much time as you did before, do you find yourself overwhelmed with trying to implement schemes and um, plays and get certain stuff in for your players? Yeah, without question, because now you have to really choose, you know, what you really want to have in. Um, you know, and, and that number might go from if you had in your mind you wanted to have ten things in, now it has to be like five things or six things. So it's kind of now hard to choose those five or six things out of ten. So it is, you know, a little overwhelming. At and, times. And coach, with less than four weeks away from the season, mm -hmm. what do you find the team really needs to work on? What are some of the things you're focusing on right now? <laughs> everything. <laughs> you need to work on everything. So but we try to focus on defense. You know, uh, I think that we got enough guys that's creative enough that can score the basketball. So if we can play some defense, then hopefully we'll have a chance to, you know, score the basketball then. Okay, and lastly, um, with so many returning players coming back and especially um, players with experience on a division one level, what's been some of the benefits of that? Oh, that it's been some of it. It's been the ability to catch up a little bit because some of a lot of stuff is like review course instead of like a, a a whole new everything to you know to most people. So it's like it's been good in that aspect. You know that we only have four new guys and ten returners. So that's probably been the best thing about the whole team. Now, if it was last year when we had ten new guys and only four guys coming back, then you know you know pray for me. <laughs> so. All righty, and coach, what are some things that you're looking forward to as the season gets closer? Uh, I'm, I'm just looking forward, you know, to competing. I'm a competitor, um, you know, looking forward to the challenge of this season. I think that this, this season is going to be a huge challenge for everybody, right. not just Norfolk State. So just looking forward to competing in this challenge. All right. Thanks for your time, Coach. All right. Thanks. Appreciate you. And we're here with men's basketball guard Joe Bryant. Joe, tell us, how much did you miss being on the court with all this time off? Uh, I miss being on the court uh, because I miss being with my, around my teammates and coaches, still like my family. So. With me being around, not being around family, I just miss the guys a lot. And what's the camaraderie been like since you guys been able to practice and play together again? Um, it's just like a big family reunion, basically. Uh, seeing all the guys' smiles and faces and uh, just being on the court with my brothers is uh, mean, it means a lot. So with quarantine going on and all this time off, what were some things that you told yourself to motivate yourself to keep going or some things you did to stay in shape during this time? Um, just I've been talking to family a lot. Uh, they just telling me just, just stay with stay stay the course, stay with it, and everything will be fine. And with less than a month away before the season officially starts, what are some things that you feel like the team <coughs> needs to work on? Um, just continue to uh, trust the system. Uh, Coach Jones has a good system that he that he has, and he's putting in so far. But all we have to do is just trust the system, and everything should be fine. And lastly, Joe, do you have any personal goals that you've set for yourself for this upcoming season? Uh, I do, but I'm not going to talk about it right now because I feel like team success comes with personal success. So if my team do good, then I would do good. All right, Joe, thanks so much for your time. Thank you.